Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this video, we will be solving one nonlinear equation that is x power 5 plus 5 power x is equal to 100. For this, we have to find out solution, roots or solution. So, if you think x power 5 is algebraic function, f5 power x is exponential function, we can draw the graph or we can solve using algebra. So, algebraically, if you are solving this equation, that would be tedious task. You cannot take logarithmic. So what I am going to do here, I am going to solve this equation using one of the known iterative method that is newton ramson method. Let me write its name newton ramson method. So formula for that method is xn plus 1 is equal to xn minus f of xn over f dash of xn. This is our formula. How we will find out? Let me start. I am finding f of 2. What is function f or fx? Let me write here. fx I am considering. Take 100 towards left. So x power 5 plus 5 power x minus 100. This is fx. Find out f of 2. So 2 raised to the power 5, 32, plus 5 raised to the power 2, 25, 32 plus 25, 57, minus 100. So minus 43, negative. F of 3, 3 power 5 more than 100, 5 power 3, 125, all more than 400, 500. So if you will take away 100, it will be positive. Important point. We, on a number line between 2 and 3, function is changing its behavior. At 2 it was negative, at 3 it is positive. That means in between somewhere it will intersect x axis. That means it is our solution. Now we will find out this solution using Newton Ramson method. But is this the only solution? We will conclude. This is statement also, whether it is only solution or is there other solutions possible. So we will talk about that. Let me calculate this root first or solution first, which is in between 2 and 3. So once it is clear, F2 is negative, F3 is positive, one root is there in between. Let me consider this formula for Xn equal to 2. So a smallest value between 2 and 3 is 2. I am taking xn as 2, the smallest one. Okay. xn plus 1. Formula is this one. xn minus f of xn over f dash of xn. So let us apply that formula. xn I will write 2. So it will be 2 minus f of 2 over f dash of 2. So you have to put the value here and you have to calculate. Now f dash is also required. So I will calculate f dash x also. That value will be 5x power 4 plus 5 power x a power x ln 5. This is our f dash x. Simply put x equal to 2 in both the equations fx and f dash x. Your f2 and f dash 2 will come out. So once you put the value it will come out 2 minus minus 43 divided by 120.2359. After putting means dividing and if you will sum up the value, it will come out 2.3576. First iteration, this is first ITR I will write. This is first iteration. So let us consider the next iteration. So for next iteration, I will consider xn is equal to what you calculated here, 2576. You started with xn equal to 2. Now next value is xn is equal to 2.3576, which you calculated just before. So now xn plus 1 will be equal to 2.3576 minus f of 2.3576 same task you have to do 
once you apply all the value f of 2 put the, there use calculator find out then that value will come out 2.2811 2.2811 this is your second iteration okay now this 2.2811 will be the xn value for the next stage iteration. Let us consider. Now third iteration. Let me write first xn is equal to 2.2811. xn we will consider which we calculated in the previous stage. So now xn plus 1 will be equal to 2.2811 minus f of 2.2811 over f dash 2.2811 if you will put all the three values then your answer with this value will come out 2.2757 this is your third itr now for next means fourth itr I will consider xn equal to this value which we calculated 2.2757. Now xn plus 1, apply that value 2.2757 minus f of 2.2757 over f dash 2.2757. This is a dash. So put all the three values respectively. Your value will come out 2.2757. Now one point is noticeable. At the beginning, let me change this. At the beginning, it was certain that between 2 and 3, between 2 and 3, our solution is there. One solution is there for sure. After first iteration, you can see that value came out 2.3576 which is more closer towards 2. So that means after first iteration it was clear that our solution will be closer towards 2. It won't be closer towards 3. Mean it, it, it is not coming out more than 2.5. So it will come down, down, down towards 2. After second iteration the value came out 2.28 2.2811 again closure towards 2 after third iteration it is 2.2757 so you can see what we are doing this by this iteration method we just calculate one intermediate route by applying newton ramson formula and then we will consider what we calculated just before that stage. That value is the xn value for next stage of iteration. So that value is 2. Point. Now you can see it is repeating itself. That means you can stop here. Your x is 2.2757. This is your solution. You can check if you want to check one or two more values or more iterations. You can check. But it is certain that that 2.27 is sure it can vary 57 can vary but if you if you want to check third digit or fourth digit then you can take one more or two more iterations otherwise 2.27 is for sure now come to is this solution means x equal to 2.2757 is the only solution so we will talk about that. See, the graph I am just trying to, this is the graph of x power 5. x power 5 is odd function. You can see x tending to plus infinity, value will be plus infinity. x tending to minus infinity, value will be minus infinity. Graph will be like this. This is x power 5. Now exponential. 5 raised to the power x. So that value will be 5 raised to the power x. You can see it is again 
once I will move from minus infinity to plus infinity, graph is bending towards upward. That means increasing function it is. In this case also, x power 5 case also, you if you will move from minus infinity to plus infinity, graph is increasing upward. Okay. So once you add both the functions, once you add, it will be like this. Nature would be as it is monotonic increasing, it can't change. You cannot change the nature of that function, which is monotonic increasing. So sum is also monotonic increasing. You can see it is raising and monotonic increasing function. Now point is right hand side is constant function. One function is monotonic increasing. Another function is constant function. You can see this is y equal to 100, which is constant function. And this is function which is monotonic increasing in nature, increasing function. That means you will get only once intersection. Your intersection will come out only one time, only once. So if one function is monotonic increasing, another is constant, you will get only once uh, intersection. If vice versa means fun suppose uh, function is decreasing and second function is constant, again you will get intersection at only one point. So this is something which you should aware. Now point is, if suppose I want to f of x, consider this function again, x power 5 plus 5 power x minus 100. And I want to draw the complete graph of that function. I am coming to that part also. So this intersection point is what we calculated 2.2757 where function value is 100. You can check this function, this point is put x equal to 0, f of 0 will be 0 plus, you can calculate that value, 0 plus 5 power 0. So that means 1. So for this function, this value would be 1. You cannot means if you are trying to find out maxima or minima, you will get this graph. For this particular graph, I am talking about. So ultimately, the total value is 2.2757 is the only solution. You can verify by this graph. See the function, constant function is this y equal to 100. And x power 5 plus 5 power x is the graph other given. See this graph. At this point, we are getting this intersection on y axis is 1. Function, see it is very compressed in form. Actually, I want to take that graph in this way that this y equal to 100 should come. Now, suppose this is y equal to 100. Now, you are getting one intersection point graph is easily understandable you can easily understand this the left hand side function is increasing so right hand side function is constant ultimately one function is increasing another is fixed constant then you will get only one point intersection and this point is 2.2757 i hope you understood what i actually want to put in front of you all so thank you so much for watching. Solution is there. If you like this video, please do subscribe my channel and give like impression. Thank you so much for watching.